boys welcome back to another video season 5 has just dropped it is absolutely insane new pois new weapons everything warzone's popping and today they just added two new weapons the tactian smg as well as the em2 assault rifle now today bro this gun is absolutely nuts as you can see i've i've leveled it up i've completely got everything maxed out i've been grinding all day and let me tell you these attachments are absolutely insane they make the gun have literally zero recoil at all like the gun literally doesn't move and the bro the damage behind this weapon literally just oh bro I, I can't even explain it bro this gun just absolutely shreds first off we got the agency suppressor for that sound suppression vertical recoil control muzzle velocity and extended damage range this is going to keep you off the radar and it's going to you know level out that recoil and make it like way easier to hit shots at range uh it also keeps you off the mini map and uh, this is going to be super clutch uh, when you're trying to close out those end game and uh to stacking up those dubs the next attachment we have is the 25 inch task force barrel same again muzzle velocity horizontal and vertical recoil control with extended damage range this attachment heavily and i mean heavily slows down the gun so if you're going to put this attachment on just make sure that you're ready for your gun to aim in like an absolute bus the next attachment we have the field agent grip once again horizontal and vertical recoil control this is going to iron out that recoil significantly and like i said bro the damage that this thing can put over range is absolutely disgusting the fourth attachment is going to be the 40 the 40 round mag i usually play solos and duos so i pick 40 round mag if you play trios and squads you may want to run a 50 round mag but for solos and duos i run 40 and for the last attachment it is a sight of your choice i personally like the 3x uh i've also been experimenting with where is it the susap multi zoom i've been experimenting with this a lot it takes a lot of that visual shake away and it just makes the gun an absolute laser beam so with that said we're going to jump into a game of solos and we're going to put this gun to range boys use this gun you guys won't be disappointed me mo hit the like button comment down below what's your favorite thing about season five and as always have an absolutely fantastic day i feel like so oh, this thing is fucking ass Season 5 is a disappointment. Well, they added a few good stuff, but there's like, there's not real. It's not like nothing's really changed. Like, don't get me wrong. They've added a few cool things, but at the end of the day, really nothing has actually changed. Like, you would think adding new weapons and perks, the gameplay would sort of change a little bit, but no, the gameplay is literally the, the exact same. Hey guys, new assault rifle, completely balanced. Burn balanced. Yeah, yeah, hospital is the play, I think. Same time, there's no point even rushing the hospital and then having the move, so I guess I'll go top. Top not gonna tell me. I heard someone. Oh, the zone isn't even, like, close to moving. Oh, fuck. 
I wonder if you can make it to top hospital from here. Oh my god, you probably. Oh my god, it looks like you can. Wow, you can make it to top hospital from from top Nakatomi. What? That is actually so cracked. Wow. The more you know. The more you know. I didn't even know you could do that. Actually, really good to know. game without any vehicles it was whenever they disabled them for like that stupid exploit gonna be a really tricky end zone to play to be honest i think low ground in that building is the definitely the play low ground not high ground Oh shit, maybe I should spread them out. There we go, chilling. Chilling. Wait for zone to close. Actually, it was a pretty good rotation. Guys at the very, very top, just closed the metal door. Oh, I'm still naming people left in this zone. Wow! Looks like up, looks like up, up, up here was definitely the play. It's not that it's bad. It's it's not that it's a bad perk. It's just like it's kind of useless, especially for solos. People just over exaggerate everything. I'm so dead here if anyone shoots this. Only four enemies remain. You know what to do. Transmitting coordinates for airstrike. Tracker three one, good copy. Stack it back. In. The safe zone. No 1v1, probably the guy that was uh, top of the apartment building. But a cluster, because when you call in a cluster, you don't show up on the minimap. Transmitting coordinates for air strike. Jeez. 